Hello everyone, my name is Brennan and I'm a pianist here on YouTube. Today we're going to be learning the song Photograph, which is by Arcade Fire from the movie Her. This is actually one of my favorite piano songs of all time and I'm super excited to show you guys how to play this one. Before we get started, I want you to consider subscribing to my channel. It really does help me out a lot here on YouTube and I appreciate every single one of you guys. And with that, let's get right into the video. So before we get started, I'm going to go ahead and play a preview of the arrangement that you'll be learning in today's video. Okay, so this is a little bit of a tricky song. I think the best way that I'm going to teach this is just with both hands together because the patterns kind of interlock with each other. So just be patient with yourself. If you're not getting it right away, just know that this song is going to take quite a bit of practice. All right, here we go. So the first little pattern in the right hand is going to be thumb on E, pointer finger F, middle finger A, and pinky on C. And you're going to start at the bottom and then go. So you're going to go back and forth from the bottom to the top. You want to make sure that you're not bleeding them all together like this. You want to make sure they're very concisely separate, but also playing it quick. So then in the right hand, you're basically going to go pinky and F, then you jump up here to E and then C. And then that repeats. Then it goes D, F, C, D, F, C. Now the tricky part is that the pattern comes in between each of these. So how it's going to go is F pattern, E pattern, C pattern. So basically after each key, you do the pattern. on D, pattern, F, pattern, C, pattern, D, F, C. Again, it's a little tricky, so both hands together, it's going to sound like this. hand jumps from here up to here. So then you're playing with your thumb A, B flat, D, F. So it's and it's the same pattern, just different keys. Okay, and then in the right hand it's gonna go B flat, A, F, B 
B-flat, A, F. Okay, so let's try this with the pattern here. B-flat, A, F. And that repeats, but you play it obviously a little bit faster. Okay, then it changes again. Then it goes down to here. So you kind of have to memorize the shapes of where your hands go. And again, this is a practice point. So then you have your thumb on F, pointy finger G, middle finger B flat, and pinky up here on D. So it goes same pattern. Except in our left hand, now we go G, pattern. And then we jump up to B flat, D. So it goes G, pattern. B flat pattern, D pattern. Okay, then luckily the next one is just your pinky move down to C and the rest is the same. Okay, and then the left hand is gonna go C, G, C. So we go C, G, C. Run through it nice and slow without talking just so you can see the keys. This one now just once. Down to C and move that pinky. Okay, so I'm going to run through it one more time without talking. starts over. Now at this point it gets even harder. So basically it starts all over, right? And we go same. We repeat it a second time. And then basically we do an entirely new part in the left hand now. So the patterns in the right hand are gonna stay exactly the same, but we're adding in a new left hand part to go along with it. So basically how it's gonna go is then at this point you go C, D, A, C, and then you stretch to F and E at the same time. So it goes. So basically you're doing this part with the earlier pattern. So this is where it gets a little bit tricky because your mind's doing like eight different things at once. So if we take out that pattern, basically how it's gonna go is C, D, A, C together. Then we do the earlier part, E, C, F. C, D, A, C. So now we switch to this one. And then we 
go up to F, C, F. So earlier we were playing E, C, F. Now it's F, C, F. So I'm just going to do this without talking just so you can hear it. And you go. So that's F, G, D, F, and then A and D at the same time. Then you go up to A, F, B flat. Then it repeats. And now you stretch to G and A. And then you move up to B flat, F, B flat. So earlier it was A, F, B flat. Now it's B flat, F, B flat. So again, just watch me do it here. Again, not adding this pattern here. It's going to go like this. super, super duper tricky. Okay, so now we're gonna make it even harder for ourselves, because we love that, to now add in this pattern. Okay, so here we go. So basically you're pretending like you're gonna play it like you did earlier, but you're actually gonna add in this new complicated part. So what I mean is it's gonna go pretending like, is super duper tricky but what I'm gonna basically tell you to do is you kind of speed up the right hand a little bit and the thing that you need to pay attention to what's leading the show is the left hand and the right hand kind of gets blurred into it so I'm gonna try and slow it down as much as I humanly can so that you can hear the timing so it's show you how you then switch to the next part. Basically then you need to go and then when you hit these two is when you move the right hand up to here. I'm already losing the timing just by slowing it down. So it's one of those you kind of have to play it fast just to get the timing of it. So what I think I'm going to try and do here is go through it again and then just slow down my hands as much as I can. I know I'm playing it pretty fast, guys. Um, but without that, you kind of lose the timing if you don't play it fast. So I'm gonna just run through it without talking a few times 
and then hopefully you guys can catch on that way. Again, I'm sorry to do that to you. I know it's a very difficult song, but here we go. phrases is then it goes on to this one right so you can hear the timing on that. if you're not getting it right away. What I do recommend doing is listening to the original song and if you can even, if there's a way to maybe listen to it on YouTube and kind of slow the speed down, then you would be able to hear the timing in the original piece. But like I said, you kind of have to learn it really fast and just practice, practice, practice. That's how I was able to learn this song is just listening to it repeatedly and then practicing it that way. Because I don't use sheet music or anything, so I'm not able to provide that for you guys. Uh, but hopefully this tutorial was helpful in the way of like breaking it down and the timing and which keys to play. So we're going to roll through it one more time and then call it a day. All right, here we go.
So basically that repeats, and then at the end, you do similar to the song on the beach tutorial, if you haven't seen that yet. Uh, I have it on my channel, but then it goes to... Alright guys, and there you have it. That is the entire piano tutorial for the song Photograph, which is written by Arcade Fire and Owen Pallet from the Her soundtrack. If you guys enjoyed this video, definitely consider subscribing to my channel. I truly appreciate all of you and it really does help me out on YouTube as far as the algorithm and making sure that my videos get seen. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to create art and I'll see you guys next time.